Hello everyone, hello YouTube. My name is Vic of Use Market Biz, and I'm back again to um, bring you the latest news on cryptocurrencies and of course our updates on the newsletter. Okay, so as we all know that this newsletter is the newsletter that the subscribers will receive once they subscribe at this website. So it's called preferredcurrency.news. Okay, guys, so this is only for $15 a month. Or $180 a year, okay? Just keep note of that. So, um, here it is, right? So, you can also pay in crypto for the subscription here at the website by clicking this um, Coinbase logo. And if you want to pay in fiat, you can use PayPal by clicking this logo also, right? So, Okay, so let's go to the newsletter. So this is the newsletter that the subscribers received some hours ago, right? So we all know that first thing that we're going to see once we open the email because this newsletter is mailed to you personally, right? So we all know that this is the first thing that we're going to see. Okay, so the first update, news update today is, okay. So, how Silvergate became the leading bank for crypto startups, right? So, it's been a long journey for Alan Lane. Since the Silvergate Bank CEO bought his first Bitcoin in 2013, okay? That was around the time his small deposit hungry bank, based in La Jolla, California, took in its first crypto exchange as a client. It was a gutsy move for a financial institution, since at the time most bankers viewed Bitcoin as either a fad, a scam, or a reputational and regulatory risk. If they had even heard of it all. Okay, so speaking Friday on the Block FS conference in New York, Lane recalled, "Here were these companies that were raising money from reputable, okay, venture capital firms. They weren't doing anything illegal. They weren't doing anything immoral." And yet they were struggling to maintain bank accounts. So I put our need for deposits together with their need for banking services. Okay, so five years later, Silvergate is arguably the leading bank for crypto startups in the US prominent exchange um, clients, including Coinbase, Gemini, Kraken, and Bitflyer. And as revealed in the bank's initial public offering prospectus filed earlier this month, Bank, I mean, the bank now works with 483 crypto startups that contributed roughly 1.7 billion in deposits to the balance sheet as of quarter 3, 2018. To overcome the crypto phobia that to this day has held back most of Silvergate's peers from serving the sector, Silvergate invited exchange executives to meet directly with the bank's regulators. Lane said during a panel discussion on banking Bitcoin startups. Even in the early days, he said, he was only interested in working with startups that had professionals with legal expertise from the traditional financial world and were wholly dedicated to the nitty-gritty of daily monitoring for ironclad compliance. At the time, most crypto startups in those days had executives juggling their worst responsibilities which were not going to cut it for a bank or its regulators. The chief compliance officer is not a multiple hat type of person, Lane said. Okay. So there's a lot of um, other, I mean, if you want to read further this um, news update, okay, subscribe now. So that our, subscribe now at preferredcurrency.news, okay? And also, um, you can read this article here at ecn.today so it's called preferred currency news so it's also here all right so this is very good news as we all know that silvergate bank is the leading crypto um, leading bank for crypto startups okay so currently they are um, working with 483 crypto startups and contributed roughly 1.7 billion dollars in deposits so imagine from uh, sta it stated uh, here that previously um, during 2013 um, his bank um, Allen Lane 
um, it was just small deposit hungry bank and then it was the time that they uh, had their first crypto exchange as a client so it was a gutsy move for a financial institution but look at them now see they're very big and most of the clients are crypto startups okay so that's the first update so the next update is this one so neo announces new fs distributed file storage competing with dropbox and amazon s3 so on november 30th neo announced in collaboration with an spcc that they are developing a distributed file storage system that would work as a cornerstone of the neo platform neofs would allow users to take back control of their data and would be as simple as as, as would be as simple to use as Dropbox or Amazon S3. Neo is a blockchain platform with its own cryptocurrency that is designed to build a scalable network of decentralized applications using widely used programming languages. The Chinese-based platform is described as a major competitor to Ethereum. In an article from Neo News Today, at the November 30th Neo Meetup held in St. Petersburg, the Neo St. Petersburg Conference Center. NSPCC officially revealed the details of NEO's upcoming distributed file storage feature. So, uh, NEO um, made their own distributed file storage to compete with Dropbox so, and Amazon S3. So, of course, the Google Drive. Okay? So, that are the sec two main updates on the newsletter today. Okay? So, let's move forward. So below that one is this one. So this is the invitation to the Telegram group of the subscribers. So this is only for the subscribers. Okay. Here. So currently there are 107, 1,792 members. Alright. Uh, next is this one. So these are very useful links. So this one is eastmarketplace.news is where it's a marketplace website where you can buy and sell using cryptocurrency right so the, once you visit that site you will be redirected to a spreadsheet that has all the information of the items that are for sale or for rent there okay here it is see um, there's currently a lot of items here and if you're interested in one of those uh, you can contact the contact numbers listed here all right the next one is PCN.today, of course, the news website. This one is also a marketplace website, just like use marketplace.news. It's called marketplace.pcn.today. Okay. See. Right, and of course their Twitter account. So follow their Twitter account at preferred crypto. And of course, preferredcurrency.news, where you subscribe to receive this very nice newsletter, right? And then this one, um, also, uh, there's an EUS wallet, which is downloadable in your favorite Google apps, um, Google Play Store, or and in your favorite App Store, which is called EUS Links. Okay, uh, okay, so to set it up, you ha just have to pay 99 cents for it, right? Okay, and if you are wondering how to sell, buy, and, uh, and rent using EUS, uh, you can... Okay, you can visit this website. So it's called eastmarket.biz. Right? So there are also other useful links here. See? All right. Okay, and the main um, highlight of the newsletter. So this is Dog the Boo's research list. So this is the update. Okay on Donald the Goose research list so these are the top points that you should include in your research list All right so these are Komodo, Kyber Network, Ontology, Substratum, Vibe, Bitbay, Davcoin, EOS, Stellar, and Zcash All right so you can open or read further the technical analysis of those coins here at this spreadsheet so the blue ones so Okay, so the blue ones are showing the best news. So the blue ones are these coins. Okay, so these coins are the blue ones rather. All right, so okay, and as you can see, it's very very full of information. 
and most are the technical analysis, of course, the description. See this one, right? So if you want to receive this newsletter, um, this spreadsheet, it is attached to this newsletter. Just subscribe at preferredcurrency.news for fifteen dollars a month, right? So, and since this is just a view only. Um, spreadsheet you can edit that one by following the instructions below the button here it is and aside from that there are also other information of other lists like this one so it's the high volume chains because this is the tokens that have a recently ex a recent extremely high volume percent increase in volume the interesting tactile price action tokens or coins the high weekly trade volume and the most searched in the go Google um, in google.com okay so these are the most search and also if you want to earn cryptocurrency each month by becoming an affiliate so that you can earn affiliate commissions for seven levels deep just join their affiliate program here by clicking this picture right or by clicking affiliate at the main website itself at the upper right corner and this is the indicator that you're already um, logged in this one see there's a dashboard at the top so that means that you're already logged into the affiliate program right so here it is here's the dashboard and here's the creative section where you can have your affiliate link this one so this will be the link that you will be using in your um, postings okay right so other from other than that, um, there's also the lists here of the EUS airdrops that are that are nearing its drop date. So this one, the first one is Parcel Reward Drop. Okay, so it's called Reward Drop, and they they call their token Seed Tokens. So the how to, um, the instructions in how to participate that airdrop is here also. Right. So the next one is Two Two. So it's they call their airdrop Snowdrop. Right, and their token name is Took. See, and yeah, they're nearing their drop date. So in December, and of course, CADEOS.io. See, the instructions are also here. Right, so that's it for the newsletter. Okay, so guys, subscribe now at Preferred Currency Not News. I know you'll be liking this newsletter. Right. Okay, so that is the uh, affiliate homepage, right? So here it is, another information. So if you're very, if you're fond of listening to podcasts and videos, okay, join this Telegram group, especially if you're an EOS holder, because this will keep you up with all the latest podcasts and videos being published for EOS. So currently there are three hundred eight members, and this is very very nice also. The next one is this one. So if you are, if you do, if you want to join Initiative Q, because Initiative Q is the future of payments. Join. Um, use my invite link below at the descriptions. It's just below. So you use that one, okay? And then if you want to get rewarded in crypto by doing feedbacks on social surveys, download Lumios.io in your favorite app store or in your favorite Google Play Store, right? Okay, guys. Okay, so that's it. That's it. So before I go, I just want to say that I am not a financial advisor, and everything I say here is not a recommendation for you to buy and sell crypto. So you must always do your own research before deciding for yourself. All right. So guys, um, please don't forget to press the like button and subscribe. This has been Vic, bringing you the latest crypto news and the updates on the newsletter today. So. Guys, see you on the next video. Bye-bye.